All right, y'all, so let's talk about fuel filters and um, things getting in your fuel and uh, clogging up your fuel lines and um, bacteria growing in your fuel tanks. So, as y'all know, bacteria loves dark and moist places. And uh, your fuel tank is definitely one of those places. So about in the middle of the summer, I took like a whole month off. I just, you know, took some time off and my truck just sat, you know, I would come start it up periodically. But um, I noticed my, my fuel water uh, reservoir or fuel water separator, whatever you want to call this. This is my fuel filter. This, it wasn't clear like it is now. So, um, I noticed that it would just, it was slowly getting darker and darker and darker. Um, and when I jumped back on the road, you know, this was just, I changed this filter, I don't know how many times I would change it. And in like a week's time, it would just be dark and it would be like all the way up to here to where I need to change it again. So I'm like, man, what's going on? You know, my engine is, is, is new, you know, it's only, when I got it, it only had like 10,000 miles on it. It's got like a little bit over 100,000 miles on it now. So, um, I didn't know what was going on. I thought, man, I know I know these injectors ain't going already. Um, so, I was like, I don't want to believe that it's the injectors already. So, I did some research. Of course, I'm, I looked online or whatever. And I didn't... You know, as long as I've been trucking, you know, that's why I say, you know, don't ever be, you know, always be humble enough, uh, enough to learn something, no matter how much you think, you know, um, I wasn't aware of the fact that you gotta, you gotta treat your fuel tank so that bacteria doesn't grow, especially with the type of diesel fuel that we use nowadays with the biodiesel and all of that, you know, um, it's, it's easy for bacteria and stuff to grow in your fuel tanks. So what i did was i went and got this uh stuff i got this stuff out of the truck stop made by uh diesel power service um it's some some type of fuel treatment they got i forget the exact name of it but it's in like a, a white bottle with some red lettering on it diesel power service and uh, i put that in there first to kind of like treat it right and um i noticed you know it the truck felt a little bit better as I was riding, you know, the engine felt better and this started to clear up a little bit But you know, it wasn't it still wasn't just you know what I wanted It wasn't clear like this, but it was getting better And so I came across this stuff uh, This is called kill em. And you see right there it says kills bacteria and slime and fuel and uh, this is what got me back to looking like this clear. I put, and it didn't take much, you know, like a couple of caps. It says, um, um, I forget the ratio you use, but it's not much. Basically, you put, uh, you squeeze, squeeze this right here. You squeeze the bottle and it fills up in this, in this little part right here. And uh, this little part right here fills up. And once that's to about an ounce, maybe a little bit more, you pour it in one, one full tank of fuel and then you do it again for your other fuel tank on the other side. But um, this stuff right here, it works, man. Um, shout out to whoever manufactures this. This is some good stuff. So, um, what I do now is, you know, at least once a week, I put some of this in my fuel tank, man, just to to keep my fuel clean and keep that bacteria from growing. So just know, man, you know, bacteria does grow in your fuel. You got to keep that fuel clean, keep those lines clean, because um, that bacteria, man, it'll start to darken up your 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 fuel. Um, and you don't want that dirty fuel getting in in your your uh, your engine and your injectors and stuff, you know. So that's just a little tidbit, little quick tip for for all you truck owners out there, man. Keep that fuel clean. 
All right. Uh, I don't know. I'm not associated with these people at all, uh, but um, they definitely got my endorsement with this because it works and I'm into stuff that works. So that's all I got for y'all for now. All right. I'm out. Peace.